So firstly, Kajabi is an all-in-one platform built for creators, coaches, and entrepreneurs who want to sell digital products without needing to have tech skills or a bunch of different softwares. I personally like to think of Kajabi as a digital product version of Shopify. That said, on Kajabi, you can build websites, launch products, run email marketing, host courses, take payments, and so much more. But with all the possibilities and features inside of Kajabi, I know it can become overwhelming. So my goal with this video is to help you set up the six key things so that you can start making money with your online business as quickly as possible. That said, if you haven't joined Kajabi and you wanna follow along with this tutorial, I have an extended free trial link that gives you 30 days free instead of the usual 14 days on their website in the description below for you. Alongside this extended free trial, you'll also get immediate access to a bunch of free resources like my 10K digital product blueprint course, product mock-up templates, AI prompts to create your digital products in seconds, and high converting email sequences to actually sell your digital products. So with all of that out the way, let's move into step number one, which is setting up our foundations. So to ensure our accounts are properly set up and everything in our business runs smoothly, we first want to head over to the settings tab. From here, click site details and here we can add your brand name, logo and brand colors. Next, we can connect a custom domain here, but if you don't have one yet, you can use the free subdomain that you get with your Kajabi subscription. So instead of having a website like www.takumishigen.com, it'll be something more like this. I personally get all of my domains from GoDaddy or Hostinger, so if you're interested, I've left some links in the description below. But under that, you'll also want to set your default currency, so this will be the currency you charge for all of your products inside of Kajabi. But now, if we go back to our settings and this time click Marketing Settings, we now want to add your business address. And this is super important for email compliance. And whatever you put here will automatically show up at the bottom of all of your marketing emails. Under that, you can also set your default email settings, so things like your from name and emails. Now from here, if your business is set up in the US, UK, Australia, or Europe, then I recommend setting up Kajabi Payments. So Kajabi Payments allows you to accept payments from all the major credit card brands, and it also allows you to do things like Afterpay and Klarna which gives your customers even more options when purchasing your products. But now moving on to step number two, which is building your lead generation funnel. And this step is something you're gonna do multiple times during your Kajabi journey, because building your email list is one of the most important things you can do as an online business owner. Emails allow you to have a direct line of contact to your audience, and it allows you to take ownership over your audience. Because unlike social media where algorithms can hide your content or accounts can disappear, your email list is yours. And the best way to build your email list is by using a funnel. And basically a funnel is just a simple step-by-step -step experience that you create to guide someone from I just found you to I trust you enough to buy from you. That said, depending on which stage of business you're in, this will determine which type of funnel is right for you. So inside of Kajabi, they make it super easy to create funnels with just a few clicks by using their one-click funnel templates. So to do this, head over to marketing and then click on funnels and then hit get started. From here, we're gonna see all the different funnel templates that are available to us. And we can click this show me how tab to get a breakdown of the funnel that's gonna be created. So for example, for the freebie funnel, you can see an opt-in page, an email, and a thank you page is gonna be created. So again, depending on what stage you're in for your business, this will determine which funnel is best for you. But to make it simple, if you're still building out your product, then I recommend creating a waitlist funnel. This type of funnel will allow you to start capturing emails before your product is ready and and this will allow you to have a warm audience ready to buy your products when you launch. You can also use your waitlist as a way to speak to your potential customers and to find out what exactly they are struggling with. That way you can ensure your product solves their problems. One of the biggest mistakes I made when I sold my first photography course was not building and promoting a waitlist. So to avoid the mistake I made, click on get started here, add a title and then create funnel. From here, Kajabi will automatically populate the waitlist funnel for you. And from here, we can make any adjustments to the opt-in page, email or thank you page just by clicking on them and then making any adjustments that we want. This one-click funnel feature is so powerful because creating funnels used to be something that would take me hours and even days to create. So this feature alone is gonna save you hours of your time and a bunch of stress. That said, if you already have a product 
product and you're now wanting to make more sales, I recommend creating a freebie funnel. And this freebie funnel is basically another word for a lead magnet, which is when you give something valuable for free in exchange for someone's email. And this can be anything like a free training, a guide, a community, a download, and etc. So here's an example of one of my most popular lead magnets, which is a free 21 day email course that teaches you how to build and monetize your knowledge brand. And on the sign up page, you can see I have a clear headline and call to action at the top of the page. And as we scroll down, you'll see I've added more information about what you'll receive. And I've also added testimonials to increase my social proof. That said, if you want to check out this freebie for yourself, I've left a link in the description below for you. That said, one thing I want you to keep in mind is that depending on which subscription tier you're on for your Kajabi account, you're going to have access to a limited amount of funnels. So there are advanced ways to create these funnels without using up one of your funnel slots in your subscription, but it does become a bit more technical and it does take a bit more time. So if you want me to create a full in-depth tutorial about it, let me know in the comments below. That said, once you've created your funnel to start collecting emails, you're now ready to create and set up your product. So to do this, go to the products tab and here you're gonna see all the different types of products you can create for your business. And whatever product you're creating, Kajabi has made it super simple for you to create. So for example, let's say you wanna create a course. All you need to do is click courses and then new course. So from here, you wanna add in the name of your course and a brief description about it. And when it comes to choosing a name for your course, I like to have something transformative in the name or the amount of time it's gonna take for someone to go through the course. So for example, 21 day photographer or zero to 10K blueprint. With that said, inside of Kajabi, you can change this name whenever you want. So you don't need to overthink it right now. For the description, I usually like to answer these three questions. So who is this course for? What transformation is being delivered? And how is the transformation being delivered? So for example, I've written, this course is for burnt out service providers who want to stop trading their time for money by creating scalable digital products. This five module course will walk you through the step-by-step -step process of productizing your skills into a profitable digital product that can be sold on autopilot while also establishing a personal brand and becoming a go-to authority within your industry. Now from here, you're gonna make sure this toggle is on because this will now allow Kajabi's AI bot to take the information you just entered to create your course outline for you. So once you've done that, hit next and on this page, you're now gonna set your course's appearance. So it's here where you can add your branding colors and a thumbnail image for your course. For this thumbnail, I have a template that allows you to easily adjust the text and product box to your course and brand. And this is an exclusive template that I send out to anyone who uses the extended free trial link in my description below. But with that said, if you have your own graphic, you can just easily upload it here. But once you've done that, click next, and now you're gonna set the price of your course. So here you have options of making this free or paid, and you can also choose if this will be a one-time payment or a subscription. So to keep things simple, let's just choose one-time payment, and here just add in the price you wanna sell your online course for. And once you set your price and connected a payment method to receive payments from your students, hit next, and now Kajabi's AI tool will not only start building out your course outline for you, but it's also gonna create a sales page and an email sequence for you. So after a few seconds, we can see that Kajabi has created the foundations of our course, and we can now go into any of these modules and trainings to upload our course videos and make any adjustments. Within Kajabi, you can also add quizzes and a bunch of different automations to really take your course experience to that next level. But again, since this video is focused on getting you up and running as quickly as possible, let's move on to step number four, and that is building your sales page. So if you followed the previous step and turned on the Kajabi AI toggle, then Kajabi's AI would have created a sales page for you. So to check that out, head over to website, landing pages, and then open up the page here. So here we're gonna see what Kajabi's AI has created for us. And by using their simple drag and drop page builder, we can make adjustments to any of these features or even add new sections by clicking on an area and then in the left tab, click add content. And here we can choose from a bunch of different elements. So for example, let's say you were selling your course for $399, but then you also had a split pay option that was $250 over two months. So you could add two pricing cards here and make any text adjustments by clicking here and just typing. That said, the options are endless with how you wanna edit and design your sales pages. But a key thing to remember is to make sure your pages are mobile optimized because over 60% of web traffic comes from mobile phones. 
and Kajabi makes it super easy for you to edit your mobile layout by clicking this smartphone icon at the top here and then making any adjustments that you might need. That said, if you want to learn more about how to create high converting sales pages, in the description below, I've linked a free training that breaks down the exact sales page for my consistent creator system, which is the exact content system I used to gain over 300,000 followers across social media in just seven months. This sales page generated over $30,000 in sales for my digital product in just three months. And in this free training, I break down every section and I cover why I designed it the way I did. So again, if you're interested, the link for that is in the description below. But now that we have our product and sales page ready, the next thing we're gonna set up is our checkout page so that we can actually start accepting payments. So to do this, head over to sales and then click on offers. And once inside, you should see the product that we just created before. So go ahead and click that. And then from here, we wanna click edit checkout. This will now take us to the page builder and here we can make any adjustments that we want. So to edit this text, click on the page content tab and here we can adjust the offer title and the checkout description. So personally, I just keep the offer title as the name of my digital product. So for example, 10K digital product blueprint. In the checkout description, I usually like to add everything that they're gonna receive when joining the program. So here's an example of what that could look like. I also recommend adding a testimonial if you have one by clicking add testimonial and then uploading a photo and all the text here. That said, if you have multiple products to sell already, I also recommend adding an order bump to your checkout page to give your customers an option to add your additional products to their cart. And this order bump strategy is super powerful because if someone is on the checkout page, they are already in a buying mood. And if you're able to present something valuable for the right price, the chance of them actually purchasing it is a lot higher. That said, once you've made all the necessary design changes, hit save and then click your product name here to take you back to the offer settings page. Now, if we scroll down, we can also add automations to this checkout process by clicking add automation. And here we can select whatever automations we want to happen when someone purchases our product. So I personally like to add a tag to all of my customers and I also like to subscribe them to some type of members email sequence. And on the topic of email sequences, that brings me to the next step in setting up your Kajabi business, and that is email marketing. So whether you're using emails to sell your products or to nurture leads, you're gonna be able to do everything inside of Kajabi. So to do this, head over to marketing and then email campaigns. From here, click new email campaign, and here you can decide if you wanna send a broadcast, which is a one-off email, or an email sequence that is triggered by an automation. So how I like to think about the two is that broadcast emails are when you manually send updates and email sequences are when you pre-write them and they usually have an end goal. So for example, let's say I wanted to create an email sequence that all of my course students automatically get added to when they make a purchase. To do this, I can click email sequence, then add a title. So something like digital product blueprint members flow, and then I'll hit continue. From here, we have the option to choose any of these pre-made templates. And personally, I like to keep my emails simple and clean. So I just use the simple text option here. This template is also the most optimized to land in your subscriber's email inbox and not the promotions or spam folder. Because without going too into depth about email marketing, but the more spammy and promotional your emails are, the higher the chance they're gonna get flagged from Gmail and Outlook. So a good rule of thumb is to limit the amount of links, photos, and buzzwords like free in your emails. So with that said, I'll click this template, add a title, and then hit create. Now from here, I can adjust the time when this email is gonna be sent out. So since I want my students to receive this email as soon as they purchase, I'll adjust the day to zero. Now from here, I can add in the email subject line and I can click here to adjust the copy inside of the email. But now once you've done all of that, hit save and then click on the name of your email sequence here. Now here you can continue building out your email sequence by clicking new email and repeating this process. That said, there are so many ninja level things that you can do within the email marketing section of Kajabi. So if that's something you want me to dive deeper on, let me know in the comments below and I'll be sure to create a dedicated tutorial for it. But now, once you've set up all the things we've covered in this video, you're now ready to launch. So go ahead and start marketing your products. And as you start generating traffic and sales, I recommend keeping an eye on your analytics and see where and what can be optimized to make even more sales for your products. And again, this video is just scratching the surface of what is possible inside of Kajabi, but I hope this training took away some of the overwhelm of getting your business set up. Because I totally get it, with all the possibilities inside of Kajabi, it can cause a bit of analysis paralysis. 
That said, some other helpful resources that you can check out inside of the platform is firstly Kajabi University. So to get here, head to your Kajabi dashboard and then click visit university. So Kajabi University will give you access to a library of in-depth training videos for every Kajabi feature. They also run regular webinars with successful Kajabi users teaching you how they grew their business. That said, Kajabi Experts is another great resource where you can hire freelancers who specialize in Kajabi, you can purchase templates from other users, and so much more. And finally, be sure to join the free Kajabi Facebook group because this is a great place to ask questions, share your wins, and connect with other Kajabi creators. That said, if you haven't joined Kajabi yet, be sure to check out my extended free trial link that gives you 30 days free instead of the usual 14 days on their website. Alongside this extended free trial, you also get a bunch of free resources like my 10K digital product blueprint course, product mock-up templates, AI prompts to create your digital products in seconds, and high converting email sequences to actually sell your digital products. So if you want to get access to 30 days free of Kajabi and all of those bonuses, click the link in the description below.